what it is, but we don't have the time to really worry about it now. God, Where are you going to go, Bigby? Find the witch. So you leave Crane alone, and we leave you alone. I'd love to join you, but there's some business I need to attend to. No, no, I'm better off dealing with things alone. I don't need sympathy and I don't need charity. Oh, shit, shit. Guys, where do you think I should go? I don't know where to go. D's office, Crane's apartment. Okay. All right, let's think about this logically. If we're looking for Crane, I doubt he's going to be at his office. Oh, you think I should actually go to Crane's? Because I don't think he'd be at his office. Polly will probably be upset with me, but she may have some evidence or clues that might help me. And D's, I really don't like Tweedledee or Dumb, but you said Crane's, and you know what? Since you're a fan, I'm gonna do what you ask. We're gonna go to Crane's Crane's office. place is right here. I should check that out first. Perfect. And I'll go to those two imbeciles' office. Crane's penthouse number is 1903. Let me know what you find. I hope you know what you're doing. I hope I do too. By the way, Nathan, I got a whole bunch of drinks and water and stuff in case you guys, you know, give me water intoxication. What big eyes you have. All right, find more clues on what he's doing. You know what, Nathan, you got a, you got a good plan. Snow said Crane lives in 1903. Oh, so I was in the wrong one. Okay, all right, all right, all right. And the door is open. How convenient. Why is the door open? Exactly. He wants to talk. No, no. There's no talking. Open. Crane? One hour and 55 minutes left. Wait, does this thing actually time me? What kind of weirdo has a bust of themselves him. in their house? There's Jeez. gotta be something about his witch here. All right, let's... Let's be nosy. Let's look around. Just a bunch Same of wine. brand we found in the open arms. Okay, so what's that? There's a message. And I think we should listen to that message. She didn't Many say her years name. Years. Merry Christmas, Mr. Crane. Thank you for everything, dear. Oh, God, he used to teach in the old days. Who the fuck is Jeremy? Is this the headless horseman? Oh my God, it is. Okay, is there anything in the desk? You know what? Let's be nosy. What does that say? My dearest Snow, I know you must be aware of my feelings towards you. Watching you work, if I'm unable to control myself, it's because I love you. <sighs> That's not love. That is obsession. That is weird. Love me less, honey. Crooked man. This is all I could get. I'm afraid Snow will start to notice. I'll have the rest for you next week. Ichabod Crane. What's going on here? Is Jeremy messing with Crane? Yeah, I'm confiscating the money. 
You know what I needed for a beer? Oh, key. I'll be taking that. Might be useful. Okay. Is there anything else in this house? Okay. Some kind of pitcher? I've never seen him that excited. Guess things have changed. Okay. Math, science, history. I had to guess. This shit didn't work. The joy of love making. Oh, I thought, I thought the doorbell rang. I'm like, what the hell? Thought I had to hide or something. Okay. Can I go out to the terrace? I cannot. I feel like I'm missing something. Okay, nothing over there. Okay. Go this way. Really? That's what I said. Like, who has a bust up there? Oh, I thought that can't open? Okay. Maybe the key is for this. Can I kick it open? Okay. Well, that was dumb. Okay. There's gotta be an easier way. Yeah, I guess I'll just do like a normal person and open it with a key. Uh -oh. <gasps> Jack. Wow. It is just unbelievable running into you here. I mean, do you work of for Ichabod too? Damn it. This weather, right? A little damp, I guess. But, you know, some people like that sort of thing. Explain yourself. Now. Okay, okay, okay. I know what it looks like, but before you go jump into conclusions, Crane pays me to water his plants when he's gone. It's a stipend. Then why were you throwing them over the balcony? You know I need to work. I wouldn't do it for free, right? You know me. So, anyways, uh, now that I'm done... I don't see any plants. Hey! Gotcha! Gotcha, okay. bitch! Where you going? You got me. Just take it easy. This is really fucking necessary. Stop yes! Talking, Jack. Okay, okay. I heard Crane was leaving town. I figured he owed us little people a parting gift. Or just me a parting gift. You heard? I have my sources, okay? You see how he lives. He doesn't need any of this shit. And you heard this from? What does it matter? I hear things. What else do you want me to say? I got bills to pay. Not like Crane's gonna use any of this stuff. Are you working for Crane? And tell the truth. No, I'm not working for anybody. Just take it easy. Fine. <sighs> You know, this tortured, lonely pig-eater bit's gonna get old eventually. Don't you get tired of it? I mean, what are you even doing here? Are you just wandering around Crane's apartment? I'm trying to find Crane's witch. He's supposed to be heading there. Crane's witch? Is that why he took off? Who the fuck cares about any of that? I mean, don't you think, oh, I don't know, solving these murders should be your top priority? I have reason to believe Crane might be the murderer. Give me a fucking break. Ichabod Crane? I mean, the guy's clenched tighter than a, you know, than a... Well, I'm having difficulty coming up with something appropriately tight right now, but you get what I'm... It doesn't I'm... matter if you believe it or not. I have evidence that places him at the scene of the crime, so I'm bringing him in. Okay, fine. You know what's best. Well, looks like you've got it covered. Anyway, it was really nice catching up with you. I mean that. No, you know something. Bigby, I believe you're uh, blocking the doorway there. I'm about to whoop just, your ass. Uh, squeeze through. It's actually funny I ran into you like this. I think I can help you out. 
I'm listening. Go on. I'm listening. If you're looking for Crane's witch, well, I just happen to know who she is. If you're interested, information comes at a price, though. But I'm sure you already knew that. All right. Tell me. Let's make ourselves a deal. I tell you about Crane's witch, and you forget you saw me here. One hand washes the other sort of thing. Wipe the whole incident under the rug. Fine. You got a deal. Perfect. Now tell me where I can find this witch. Ooh, he's squeezing Strong his arm. Grip. Her name is Auntie Greenleaf. Crane's been trying to keep it under wraps for years. I'm not sure what kind of a deal he's made with her, but from what I hear, he's in pretty regular contact. Where can I find her? Well, um, you see, uh, th the thing is, I don't know where you'd find her, exactly. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I know, right? But even a name is a good start, right? I mean, that's more than what you came in with. I guess that's true. Right. I'll keep my eyes open for you. If I find anything else you might be interested in, I'll be sure to let you know. I think this arrangement can be beneficial to both of us down the line. Probably. <sighs> it was just lovely running into you, baby. Hang on a second. Oh, come on. Yeah, what's in here? Is it a glamour? My dear. Do you always talk to yourself like that? Got a problem, the buddy? Uses the white deer on everything. It's Got a problem? symbol or trademark, I guess. Figured I could sell these at the Lucky Pawn. The Lucky Pawn? It's one of the crooked man's places. I work there sometimes. When I need some stability. It's a pawn shop. Get it? Yeah, yeah. Find really? Any more of these? Uh, no. You nervous about something? What do you mean? Look me in the eye and tell me you didn't steal anything else. Come on, Jack. Is that it? Pick me? Are you still here? Just keep your mouth shut, all right? You're the boss. Who are you talking to? What's he doing here? Evening, Miss White. Good evening. What's going on? He's here to help. Jack had some information about Crane's witch. Oh. What did you find out? Her name is Greenleaf. Auntie Greenleaf. But he doesn't know where we can find her. Great. Crane's meeting her at 2 a.m. And Snow, I found a note with some money attached. Green has been embezzling from Fable Town. Of course, because why half-ass being a complete sleaze ball? Do you think this is tied to the murders? This is just like I politicians. Mean, I guess it doesn't matter yet. We still have to find them. I think it's connected. Maybe the girls found out about it. I don't know. Mm, maybe. Crane's meeting Greenleaf at 2 a.m. And we have no idea where she is. We're going to cut it close as it is. We have to figure out where he's meeting her. Wouldn't she be listed in the business office? I've had Buffkin searching for any unauthorized witches, but so far we haven't found anything. I'll give him the name, but we don't have time to wait around. You should try Holly's. She still has all of Lily's things. If she hasn't burned it already. There's still Tweedledee's place. We know they're involved. And we know that's where Bluebeard went. Where do you guys do you think I go? should go? We don't have much time. Tweedledee's or Holly's? I'm going to let you guys as the viewers decide. If not, I'm just going to eeny, meeny, miny, mo it. Because I honestly don't know where to look. So we can either go to Holly's place or we can go to Tweedledee and Tweedledum, which... Honestly, I do not like Tweedledee and Tweedledum. You said Holly? Yeah, let's go. I'll go to the Trip Trap, see about Lily's things. I think that's our best option. Sounds good. I'll give Buffkin the name and hope he finds something in the records. Let me know what he comes up with. I'll be in touch. I hope you'll do the same. We'll catch him, Snow. Hang on, Jack. I want to talk to you.
He tried, though. He really tried to, like, go through the window or do some crazy shit. How much more time do I have left? 11.15! Damn it! 45 minutes left. That's not enough time. <laughs> He's asleep, you fucking idiot. Read Why the sign. Do, do that. I need to talk to Holly. Hey, look, Woody, it's the sheriff. Well, come on in, buddy. Brent, what? He's a traveler. A weary traveler in search of some hospitality, right? Yeah. I'll only be here two minutes. I just need to check through Lily's things. <laughs> Whatever. Crap. I feel so bad for Holly. Her sister died. I want a drink. I ripped Anybody off her friend. Anybody else want a drink? Friend, Swinehart said you shouldn't mix you it. You think with... I give a fuck what that fucking guy says or what you say? Grant, really, you, you shouldn't drink right now. I can't hear you when you mumble. Swinehart told me that Holly was here. I need to talk to her. Holly's asleep in back, but you won't be able to wake her. Really? Where's her sister's shit? The doc gave him both barmesidal ambrosia for the pain. Look, the deal is, if you resist going to sleep like I am right now, it gives you a very, very, very nice high. And he said that he shouldn't mix it with alcohol. And here we are. Mixing it with alcohol. Yes, he did. He certainly did. But let me tell you something. Have you seen her sister's things? What wasn't burned at the funeral? I saw her come in with something, but I didn't see where she put it. Nope, haven't seen it. That funeral back there? That was a shitty fucking send-off for a pretty okay lady. Yeah. You okay. weren't fucking there. Talking to Bigby now, okay? Can't say you being there helped things much. Gren, don't start nothing. Who's starting anything? I'm not. You think I shot up the place? It wasn't my fault. They got away though, didn't they? Whatever. It's alright. I'm too out of it to get into it. No one wants I want to, to clear you. the air. We're all in this dung heap of a fucking shit town together. We're all gonna have a toast. All of us. Fellas, I'm here for one thing. To look through Lily's belongings and get out of here. Now, yeah, right? yeah, I know, I know. And I want to help you, okay? And I will. But first, indulge me. It'll take two seconds. As a show of good faith. And after, we'll all hunt and peck for Lily's shit or whatever. I'm not drinking. And Bigby didn't come here to get loaded with you. I don't want to get loaded with him. It's just a quick slug. Not gonna hurt anybody. And then we'll, you know, help you out with your thing. The wolf among us, Slippy. Ren, the doc said you needed to rest. How many times you fucking gonna alert. warn me about it, huh? You're not my fucking mother, so just get off my back! I said I was sorry, all right? I can't do anything about it. It's done! Gentlemen. What more do you want? What else can I fucking say here? I don't want anything from you, Woody. I absolutely cannot babysit you dumbasses right now. End whatever this is so we can just move past it. Oh, I forgot. You haven't heard the news. This walking lard cake was paying Holly's sister to let him fuck her behind all of our backs. And Holly had to find out going through all of her sister's shit. 
What fun that must have been. Trick after trick of this Yo! fat ass in the living. I didn't plan for that, all right? And our thing, whatever it was, it wasn't a big deal. It wasn't. I never fucked her when she was snowing. I didn't know nothing about that. No, but you knew Holly would flip out. Oh and you knew God. for a damn good fucking reason. You know what? Fuck this. I don't need this shit. Oh, yeah, that's it. Everyone now you're in this town is an you're asshole. such a low life. I don't know why I never realized it till now. What do you think about this fucking loser, Sheriff? He can think whatever he wants. I don't give a shit. No, that's okay, because I'll tell you what he thinks. He thinks you have to pay chicks to touch your fat, hairy ass. That's what he thinks. Wait, wait. I've got some questions for you. What possible questions could you have for this piece of shit? Everything's a problem when I want to talk, but when the woodsman's about to leave, it's, oh, wait, I have questions. What do you want? When you saw Lily, did she ever mention anything about a witch? No. We didn't talk about work. All right. I mean, how desperate do you have to be that you have to pay a woman to... Grin. Pleasure you? I don't know where Lily's shit is. <sighs> Check Holly's room, I don't know. But I wouldn't wake her if I were you. Sleepwalkers and trolls. I think that's the rule. Thanks for that. Actually, Big B, if you'll excuse me, it seems that I'm gonna pass out. What a day. Am I right, Sheriff? What a fucking day. When won't remember this? Yeah, because he's drunk out of his fucking mind. I'm not waking up the Grinch here. Yeah, there's no way I'm gonna be able to grab it without her trying to fight me. You guys think I should grab it? She might tear off my arms. Hydrate. Just here for Lily's things, Holly. Yeah, go back to sleep. Big B, bars closed. And excuse me, but I'm not in the mood for entertaining. But what the fuck? I know you're not gonna leave. You do what you want. You always do what you want. I feel bad for treating them awful at the beginning of the game. But I need evidence. Is there something on the back of the picture? Do you even give a shit about us? The strays? Of course I the do. The ones that aren't in that fancy high rise. Those of us that gotta work for a living. Holly, just because I live in the woodlands doesn't mean I'm not one of your strays. I'm not Crane or Cole. I didn't exactly grow up wearing clothes. Yeah, I know you didn't. Bottle of wine. Nothing? Okay. Why'd you even come here? Evidence! There's nothing here to investigate. I can't be any use to you. I'm just... I'm tracking a lead. Huh. Yeah?
That symbol has to mean something. I feel. Glamour tube. This is what made her turn into snow. Or look like snow. And last but certainly not least, La Boc. Be honest, Sheriff. Why are you going after him? The guy that killed Lily. You could have quit a long time ago, but you're still going. Why? Did they give you this job for a reason? Or was this the only thing the business office would let you do? I'm doing this for Faith. Oh, at least you're honest. You just remember, whatever bullshit excuse you tell yourself, I'm counting on you. So don't have any more fuck-ups. There's a serial killer on the loose. Oh, another hydrate? If you were getting your glamour on this Cheers. day, then one of these has to be the witch. Auntie Greenleaf. Gotcha. Hello, this is Snow White calling. I'm looking for Bigby. Is anyone Looks there? Looks like we got an address, guys. Bigby, if you're there, pick up, okay? Snow? Oh, thank God. Tell me you found something. I got it, Snow. Her address was here with Lily's things. It's on uh, White Plains Avenue, 1284. It's an apartment complex. Great. Let's get going. All right, let's go. I don't want to miss him. I'll meet you there. All right, I'll see you there. All right, guys. Do you think we're going to find the witch? Huff and puff. Oh, Big B! I just got here. Yeah, me too. It's number 23. I haven't seen it yet. We're late. Yeah, I know. We're 14 minutes late. This is it. All right. How do you want to do this? Let's listen in. Hear anything? If anyone's in there, they're being awfully quiet. Or awfully dead. Think we should kick it in? Wait, 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 wait! What are you doing? What does it look like? Don't just kick it in! We don't know what's on the other side. Let's just save the last resort for last. Make sense? Fine, okay. What would you have me do instead? I don't know. Knock? I mean, we have no idea what's behind So they can this. hide the evidence? Are you stupid? <clears throat> Hello? Hi. You woke me up. Uh, sorry about that. Is something wrong? She you? has to be the witch disguised as the girl. Rachel, who are you? Just so we're not strangers. I'm Big B. This is Snow. Pleased to meet you. How do you do? Is there, um, is there anything you need? We're looking for a man. A skinny, pale, nervous fella. Have you seen him? My art teacher says men are a waste of time. Do you... Go to school? Sometimes. Is there something you want? I don't think I can really help you. Rachel, do you mind if I take just a quick peek around? We'll be very quick, and he won't touch anything. She has to be the witch. I'm sorry. I've been here all night. Nobody's been here. Even Big B doesn't believe her. Okay, Big B. I'm gonna trust you not to break anything. Don't get me in trouble. What are we looking for specifically? Crane. He could still be here. Yeah, I still think I call I call money no on. Been over all night. That your mom? Uh-huh. 
I don't give a fuck. I still think that she's lying. Your mama hunter? Oh no, she never that was found in the woods around Dick's Mountain, I think. Let me guess. Big band or classical? Honky tonk. No accounting for taste. <laughs> yep, there might be evidence. It's pretty rare to see a burner like this. <sighs> Dowdy. That's how we like it. I think I saw, like, a chandelier or something. Where do you buy your clothes? Fucking witches. I saw a spider over there yesterday. Oh? It was a pretty one. Oh, wait. Is he behind the tree, really? What is this? Mommy uses that to carve her trinkets. It's from the old world. Trinkets? Um, like glamours? Not here. There's no one here but me. Yeah, I doubt that. Do you like broccoli? Not really. I love it. Oh, I can't go any forward. Okay. There's nothing that looks like Crane was here either. Nothing? See? Unless this little bitch glamoured him. Do you have any pets? Not technically. I still say that she's the witch and she did some fuckery. How much longer do you think it'll be? You know what? Kiss my ass. I say that as she looks like she's like an elementary school student. Deliver to Auntie Green. The butcher. The butcher. What's that? A package having to do with someone called the Butcher. It's empty. God damn it. I shouldn't say that. Nothing. I keep getting whiffs of that aftershave of his. I do too. Can I go to bed now? Wait. Please? Could he be the little girl? No. Is that a glamour tube? Mommy really doesn't let anyone play with that. Trust me, I've tried. Oh, no, 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 no. Please, 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 just put that back exactly where you found it. No one is allowed to play with it's that. It's all right, honey. Bigby's not going to break no, it. You it's your boy. She will freak out if she discovers I've let people in here and let them touch her stuff, okay? She checks all the time to see if things move. I don't want to get in trouble. Look, I'm already grounded. Snow, come on. Are you kidding? It's a glamour tube. Something's going on here. No! Put it down! Please, don't! This isn't what you think! You gotta believe me. The guy isn't here, I promise! It's gonna be okay, Rachel. That's because you Please, are him, bro. I'm begging you. I don't wanna... I don't wanna get in trouble. when you do it that fast. I knew it. You probably knew it. You picked the wrong night to lie to me. No more lying, no more ring around the rosy, no more bullshit non sequiturs. You're done. It's over. You're gonna tell me what I want to know right now. All right, start explaining. And from the beginning. I was born in the woods to a jackal and a... None of this pathetic witchcraft crap is gonna prevent me from prying what I need from your gullet. Now Watch tell me where Crane is. I ain't a fortune teller, wolf. I have no heavenly idea where he went to. You have to know something. Unless you want a recipe for owl stew. You're an accomplice to murder. Do you realize that? You might want to check your facts on that. 
doesn't matter. I can't help you. I have no interest in being turned into a skink and crushed under boot heels. There's powers at work here beyond your pathetic authority. Whatever it is, Greenleaf, whatever it is that's keeping you from saying something... We can protect you, okay? Whatever it is you're afraid of, we can make sure that it won't come to pass. You have no idea what's going on, do you? Okay, you know what I think? I think we've been more than patient with you. This witch has been selling illegal glamours that continue to undermine everything we've built. She's harboring a fugitive that took advantage of it, and now she's resisting every attempt to make things right. I frankly don't give a crap if she's afraid for her life. We can at least make sure she never hurts us again. We're destroying the tree. No! How dare you come in here and threaten to take from me the one thing that... That tree is ancient. It's part of the family, and it's the only thing paying for this shithole apartment. And the fables who can't afford the glamours from you come to me for help. Without them, where do you think they could go? Don't give me that. You're making money off of other people's misery. Two fables are dead because of this crap. I mean, it's so too dangerous is living the stuff. Tell them the truth. You think I like being the old woman in these stories? The men are heroes, the ladies are whores, and the old hags like me get to watch everyone they love die. We have very different ways of handling our fate. And very different means to handle it, too. And I don't use it as an excuse to wreck people's lives. Isn't there another way? She's a witch. Can't she just work for us? That way she'd be official. You want to reward her for criminal behavior? We no. can't trust this woman on the 13th floor. It doesn't matter, because I'd never do it. I'm not a house cat, and I don't play well with others. Oh, trust me, no one would confuse you for a cuddly animal. Bigby, this is an order. Burn the tree. No! Look, look, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. Crane was here. He was here, and he left. He went to the pudding and pie to try to use my ring on the girls over there to get information. What does the ring do? He thinks it's the ring of dispel. Here's the protection around the girl's speech. He says pulling the truth out of them will prove his innocence. It won't, though. Damn thing lost its power decades ago. I'm sorry, but we still can't let you keep the tree. It wouldn't be right after what's happened. Big B. Please, Sheriff. Don't. Okay, well, I guess I see where I stand with you. All right, let's go. Yeah, I don't think we should burn the tree. Hey, Greenlee. Don't think this is over. I won't. Snow is not feeling it. But I don't think we should burn the tree, guys. She could be useful to us later on. I think so. But yes, are you guys gonna use any of your points? Gonna make me do sing mode, take off my glasses? What are we doing here? I see you, Nathan. And, um, George, I know your name. All right. That's Crane's car. So she wasn't lying, he is here. Great, your strip club. Hold on. Oh, do you miss a spot? Mr. Clean, come to smash up the rest of my place. Oh, I see. Come to audition, you bitch. Where's Crane? Ichabod Crane? What would that nerd have with a place like this? Tell me what you know now. Thank you. Out of our way. Hey, you can't just go in there. We have a problem. Tell me who did it. Just tell me who did it. I know you know. Mr. Crane, please. She can't help. I know you know what the plan is. I won't be held accountable for this. I can't. I can't. I'm sorry. I... Oh, my God. Big B. Wait, don't. I, I, I didn't do anything. I promise you, I didn't do anything. These girls, the, the, the girls, they'll back me up. I just have to get this... Stupid ring working, that's all. They can't talk because of that spell. But once this ring gets through, I'll know what's going on and this whole thing will be over. That's all. Please, 
I'm innocent, completely, completely innocent. The ring won't work. Greenleaf sold you out. What? No, this will work. I assure you, it, it must. I hate it. I did you. Damn you, come on. Please, tell me who killed her. My lips are sealed. You disgusting man. <laughs> How many years? What? How many years has this been going on? Too... Too many. But I didn't kill those women, Bigby. Please, I had nothing, nothing to do with that. I just... I... It just... Oh, God! We found the photos of you and Lily. I know, I know. That's... That was... I just... I just love you, Snow. I love, I love you, and, and I'm sorry I'm not Ew. Prince Charming, okay? No! I'm sorry I didn't cheat on you and run away to Europe. You don't love me, Crane. I know what this is. I've seen it before. It is not love. Exactly. That's obsession. Toxic infatuation. Bigby? I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? He's not... He wouldn't be brave enough not to put his stamp on the world like that. We've been chasing this guy. Just... Why now? Because look at him. You said you found evidence of him defrauding Fable Town, of using our money for his own ambitions. That's one thing. But don't you have doubts he's a murderer? We've both known him for so long. I can't believe I'm hearing this. Did you see how he was acting when you showed up? Yes, I know how this... This fuck-up knows more than he's saying. I don't. I don't! Uh, yes, okay, he probably does. But there's a difference between being involved and being the guy who did it. Okay, but if Crane didn't kill Faith and Lily, I'm sorry, but who the hell did? You know, when I saw you come back here, I thought this was over. This whole thing is bigger than Crane. He wouldn't have the stones to send the Tweedles after me. Somebody else is involved. Well, shit. I didn't intend for any of this to get so... You've been stealing money from Fabletown for years, haven't you? Yeah. We're not gonna kill you, so quit your shivering. I wonder if Ichabod Crane, you are under arrest for the misappropriation of Fabletown funds. You have the right to counsel, the right to depose witnesses, but as of right now, you're coming with us. I guess we know who's in charge, Sheriff. Sometimes it's fuzzy. You think you have what it takes to run that office? You think I didn't make sacrifices? I made sacrifices. And you won't be in that chair one minute before you have to give up something you care about just so the wheels don't fall off the goddamn wagon. I did the best I could with what I had. And the town took everything it could out of me. If I maybe took a little something back in return? Yeah, see, the thing of it is, we're better at this than you are. Okay, I think, I don't know what you guys think, but clearly Ichabod did something, but I think what's his name is right that he, um, it's bigger than him. What are you saying?
we go. I had to fix my camera. <laughs> that was acting weird. Alright. Okay, this is some mob shit. What's going on now? What you got there? Is that the wicked Look, stepmother? It's recently come under our attention that you're, how shall I put this, attempting to claim what is the personal property of the crooked man. He's about yay high, 120 odd pounds, pissed his sheets until he was 14. Sound familiar? I haven't told him anything. Not now, not now. Shh. The grown-ups are talking. Who are you? No, 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 no. That's not how this works. How this works is you are going to walk Crane over here. Like a good doggy. It wasn't my fault. Did she call me a dog? Shut up. You're interfering with official Fabletown business. Step aside. Snow, you about to get shot. Tweedledee. What's the, uh, you know, that thing the Mondays call me? What? My nickname. You know what I'm talking about. Uh, Bloody, Bloody Ma Mary. That's it. Thank you. And do you know why they call me that? Because some of them, they think it's funny to have their little sleepovers and go into their little bathrooms and say my name five times in the mirror. They find it less funny when I actually show up and feed their lungs to the family dog. <laughs> and I do that for a hobby. Like golf. To relax. He's in custody, so move your car. I told you he'd never just give him up. I think he's okay. about to go beast mode, guys. Oh yes, oh yes, 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 look at this shit, yes, yes! Turning into the wolf. Yes. 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 We love this. Yes. I'm pissed. Should have killed you, but I'll let you live. Part of me feels like I should have killed his ass. 
Bloody Mary doesn't give a care, though. Am I dead? It was a good show, but, you know, I just didn't know when to end. Oh, she's gonna hack me? No! You know, you wouldn't think silver bullets would work on anything. Come on, come on, come on, come on! I'm pressing next, I'm mashing! But I'm mashing, guys, I'm mashing, I'm mashing, I'm mashing! Oh my god! I'm mashing! God, why isn't it working? I mean, hey, look, I come know. Come on, I'm mashing, guys, really, I'm mashing guys. as hard as I can. <laughs> Can you argue with these results? I'm mashing. Come on, I why? Can't. Wait! Stop! What's happening, Snow? Just take him, okay? Take Crane. Just stop, please. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Snow, don't do this. He's saying to come back. It's your lucky day, kid. Crooked man says it's okay with him. Who's the crooked man? Hello, Ichabod. Got a stomach ache? You nasty son of a bitch. Oh, and just between us girls? Crane ain't no killer. I mean, look at his face. Couldn't stick a pig if his life depended. But the crooked man's probably a killer. Kinda like your boyfriend here. Or Too sent hit pussy me. to ruin a tweedle's day. <laughs> well, this is be a beautiful relationship we have with you guys. Really. I mean it. I'm jazzed about it. Out with the old, in with the new. Long with the queen. I'm sure we'll be in touch. See you around. Wow.